Before I start this review, I would like to start it by saying that everything you see has been bought by me with my money. I am not getting paid to do this. And um, the polka dots that you're going to see in a minute are my pajamas because it is 1.03 a.m. So let's get started. I am filming with one hand and probably going to do a lot of shuffling. So this is China Glaze Tronica Collection in, there we go, Cyberspace. That is what I will be wearing on my left hand. It is not as holographic as the OMG, but it is holographic, and you will see in a minute. And it is upside down. NFU62. This is going to be on the right hand. And to show it. Okay, maybe it's not working very well. But. It is holographic. Not quite as much as the NFU. So. It is holographic though. I promise you that much. Not as much as the OMG collection. And. This is the NFU. Now, this is extremely holographic. Can't tell very well. But I'm highly disappointed with this because I put it on last night. And it's already chipping. Right there. And it already chipped right there. And it's kind of even flaking off. I can't get this to focus though. I'm making it extra hard because I'm using one hand. But. you can see it started to flake off but there's beautifully holographic ah there it is you can see it now excuse all my makeup in the background in the process of moving stuff. You can see it right there. Flaking. Flaking. Chipping off. There's a china glaze. Oh! can't see it because my hand's on the way of light. Hmm. Maybe different angle. You could possibly... Ah, there's a holographic now. Sorry for the bad angle. But you can see the hollow there. Not as much as the other hand. As far as wear, China Glaze. Amazing stuff. No base coat, no top coat, no problems. There it is. No chipping. NFU. Beautiful bottle. Great hollow. Doesn't really help you much if it's chipping on you already. Ah, perfect. Can you see it right there? Can you see my thumb? That is a perfect example of how this is chipping off 
with one day of wear. I put it on and I instantly had chips. I had to go over it. I applied more than two coats. It was pretty sheer. That um, rear finger, the reason why it looks so thick is because it broke and I tried to fix it right there. You could tell where it broke right there. And I just don't feel like walking around with a nail that doesn't match the other ones. Other than this one that I fixed, these are all mine, which they're coming off a little crooked. Um, again, amazing hollow. But look at that within the review. It's chipping. So, very sad. Love the bottle. Maybe, um, and if you will watch the improve the formula. And if you, if you're listening, improve the formula to what China Glaze has done. Pretty bottle. Really cute. Corset. Back. Front. Again, China Glaze, Cyberspace, subtle, hollow, but it's there, amazing in the sun. And a few, gorgeous hollow, bad formula. Look at that. So maybe it happened because I didn't wear a top coat. I heard that did these best without a top coat, which is why I didn't wear one. China glaze, didn't need it. No chips. Or fine. Great formulation, great quality. We're very happy with China Glaze. China Glaze, if you're listening, <laughs> next year, when you do these again, have them come out this with this amazing hologram. Just don't make them suck like this. This formula was horrible. See if you can see in the light. I'm sorry for the bad angles. Just trying to make this work. Yeah, you can even see it through the bottle. You can't see it through this bottle. But it's there. One last look. China Glaze Cyberspace. And a few. Great hologram or holo. Bad formula. Maybe I'll do a review too with a top coat and see if that helps the uh, NFU. It's a quick little video before I. Uh, Put on the China Glaze new collection. I just took off my nail polish from the previous video and added some cuticle oil because they were extra dry. So I owe a big thanks to Love for Nails for watching her video on how to take care of your nails.